it's Mary Ellen. So today I got some Muji pens in the mail. I have never tried these. I thought I might as well do a video on it, right? Since I haven't tried these and I'd show you how they are. I was recommended these by April Mom Run Craft. She loves these Muji pens and I've been wanting to try them for a while. So I thought I'd just go and get some myself. I got these on Amazon. I will link these in the description box if you're interested, but I don't know if I'm gonna like them. So I'm gonna see. So I have, I bought a, let's see, doesn't say. I think I bought a 0.3 and a 0.5. Let's check them out. I did a pen review um, a while ago with like all sorts of different pens, my favorite ones. You know, I love like the Pentel Energels. I use them all the time, but I thought I'd try this. So this one looks like is a 0.5. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try it on a happy note. So maybe I'll try it in a happy planner as well because I think the paper might be slightly different. So I'm gonna write my name. So the feel is different from a Pentel Energel. I'll tell you that right now. It's definitely, I guess because these are not, no, they are gel. They're, it's like rough feeling compared. So let me just write, here's the Pentel Energel. So there's the difference between the two. And it looks like this one, the Pentel is slightly blacker. I don't know if you can see that. It is slightly blacker than this one, but that's not gonna bother me. Like this, it's not like this is brown or anything. It's just a sort of a different color black. Um, I think this is more like a warmer tone and this is more like a cooler tone. And like I said, I don't know if you can see the difference in the video, but um, I'm just gonna do just some quick cursive. So you, can you hear it? It sounds a little rough, but it's it's not like, I it, I like it. it. It feels good and I like how, like how it looks on the paper. So let's try the point three or it might be point three eight. Yeah, it's point three eight. Let's try these and see. So I'm typically one that goes for 0.5 usually, but um, I do like the point. I have 0.3s in the Pentel Energel and I do like them. Um, I like them for like, like detailed drawings especially, but I thought maybe I'd start trying to write in with a thinner pen in my planner just for a change of pace. So I'm gonna go down here. Again, it feels slightly rough and sharp, but let's try this one. And this one does too, because you, if you have like a thinner point, you're gonna be, you're gonna have like a sharp feel because it's like pointy. Honestly, in this case, I like the Muji better. Can you see, it's a little tiny bit thicker than this one, I guess because it's a 0.38, not a 0.3, I don't really know. But this one, the Muji actually felt better than this one to write with in the thinner version. So let's try just a little cursive. I actually really like that compared to this one. I don't really like writing with this. I like drawing with it. Um, but writing with it is always feels like a little uncomfortable like, cause it's like scratchy. This one definitely felt better and I like the way it looks better on the page. So that is definitely a plus. Let's try these out on Happy Planner pages. I don't know if they're gonna be any different than the Happy Notes pages, but let's try. I have my big Happy Planner here. I'm gonna write, this is this week and right now, it's Friday, so I haven't filled out Saturdays to do yet. Um, actually, I don't wanna change. Let me write over here. I'll have to write something over here. Let's see. I'm just gonna write testing out the Muji pen. 
<laughs> okay, it might be my imagination, but with this paper, it feels slightly smoother than when I write on this paper. So I think the paper is slightly different. Um, I like it, I actually like it. I think next week when I write in my planner, I'm gonna try using this. And now I'm gonna try the 0.5 in here. Whoops, that one, let me find the one I opened, okay. And again, this one feels smoother as well. That feels really smooth, actually. Let me try it again on here. Yeah, this paper is definitely smoother than this paper. I actually really like it. Let me try this again. I like both of these. Um, I'm definitely gonna probably stick to the Pentel Energel when it comes to the 0.5, but as far as the 0.3s, I'm definitely gonna switch over to the Muji. I did not get a 0.7, um, I'm pretty happy with the Pentel 0.7s, so I'm just gonna stick with that. I will use the Muji once in a while though, instead of the Pentel Energel, I think. Um, I really do like it. I do like it. Anyway, <laughs> sorry, I got sidetracked. Um, so let me know in the comments down below if you have used the Muji pens and what you think. And like I said, the links will be in the description. They're really comparable to the Pentel's, um, to the Pentel Energel. I, like, honestly, I could use either one of these and be totally happy. So it all depends on your preference, I guess, but I really do think this is a really good pen. So check that out and I will see you in my next video. Like, comment, subscribe, and um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.